okay, there is another way to come up with that, uh, this value, and we'll use your house as the example. Um, I pull up the tax records, and it shows that in 2002, they purchased it for 380000 So what I do is I go to News and Stats, and then Northwest Statistics, and then they purchased it in 2002, so I'll pull that up. And then I'll go to June, because it says they bought in June. Uh, and it's Kitsap County. All right. So we will pull this up. All right. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to um, 2002 solds. Those are pendings. These are sold residential. It's in area 142. So an in 142 June, the average price for a home was 193,164. You can see it right here. Okay, so that's the number right there. So in June 2002, the average home sold for 193,164 dollars. Okay, so then what we do is we go back to um, 2017 and then Kitsap County. Kitsap County. Open that one up. And then we're going to go to same thing, area 142, which is all the way at the bottom. Sales, solds. Okay, so we're at sold 142. Now the average is 375, 127. Okay, so uh, um, that was right there. See it right there? Now what we're going to do is uh, open up Excel. I got it all figured out. So in 2002, if they paid $193,164. In 2017, or in 2017, the, the average would be 375,127. So that's a 94% increase. If they took what they paid for their house um, times... 94%, that means their value increased $357,964.94. So if we add those two together, that'll give us a value of $737,964. So your comparables should come up somewhere around that number. And then, of course, you have to add on, um, uh, for you, Damon, you're going to add on that um uh, flight hanger. So that should uh, work. All right.